Seven days without peeing, the shocking truth. All right, get ready for a wild what if. What if you kept drinking water, but you didn't pee for an entire week? Sounds impossible, right? Let's break down what actually happens inside your body. So you drink water, your body loves it, uses it for everything from cooling down to cleaning out waste. But when you stop peeing that waste, it starts to build up. First, your kidneys go full throttle, trying to filter out toxins and extra water, but even kidneys have their limits. Within just a few hours, your bladder fills up and stretches like a water balloon. Uncomfortable? Oh yeah. But after a day, things start getting dangerous. Your bladder can only hold so much before it risks bursting. And trust me, that's excruciating and life-threatening. But even if your bladder somehow holds, your body still needs to get rid of all that extra water. So, what does it do? It starts pushing water into your blood, and this dilutes your sodium levels. A recipe for water intoxication. Headaches, confusion, nausea, muscle cramps, and if it keeps going, your brain can swell. That can cause seizures, coma, and even death. Your kidneys, they're waving the white flag by now. Too much pressure and they can shut down, leaving all those toxins to build up in your bloodstream. After a few days, definitely not a week, you're in serious trouble, kidney damage, blood poisoning, and a skyrocketing risk of death. So next time you feel like holding it in, don't. Peeing isn't just a relief, it's a life-saving superpower. Take care of your kidneys, don't try this at home, Hit follow and stay curious.